Alexandria there was an immense library and an associated research institute. And in them worked the finest minds in the ancient world. travel back into time, this is the place I would visit. The Library of Alexandria at its height 2,000 years ago. Here, in an important sense, began the intellectual adventure which has led us into space. All the knowledge in the ancient world was once within these marble walls. This library was a citadel of human consciousness, a beacon on our journey to the stars. It was the first true research institute in the history of the world. And what did they study? They studied everything, the entire cosmos. Cosmos is a Greek word for the order of the universe. In a way, it's the opposite of chaos. It implies a deep interconnectedness of all things. Uh, the intricate and subtle way that the universe is put together. Genius flourished here. In addition to Eratosthenes, there was the astronomer Hipparchus who mapped the constellations and established the brightness of the stars. And there was Euclid who brilliantly systematized geometry, who told his king, who was struggling with some difficult problem in mathematics, that there was no royal road to geometry. There was Dionysius of Thrace, the man who defined the parts of speech, nouns, verbs, so on, who did for language, in a way, what Euclid did for geometry. There was Herophilus, a physiologist who identified the brain rather than the heart as the seat of intelligence. There was Archimedes, the greatest mechanical genius until the time of Leonardo da Vinci. And there was the astronomer Ptolemy, who compiled much of what today is the pseudoscience of astrology. His Earth-centered universe held sway for 1,500 years, showing that intellectual brilliance is no guarantee against being dead wrong. And among these great men, there was also a great woman. Her name was Hypatia. She was a mathematician and an astronomer, the last light of the library, whose martyrdom is bound up with the destruction of this place seven centuries after it was founded. 